Good morning, third graders. Wishing you the best for this week. I'm going to present you the activities you have to complete for this week. Pay attention and follow the instructions in order you can understand what you are going to do. Let's start with the date. As everybody knows, today is Monday, May 4th, 2020. These activities are for week number seven, as everybody knows. Okay, then I'm going to present you our objective for these activities. I'm going to start reading this objective to identify likes, dislikes, love, and hate with present progressive. This is our main objective that you have to follow. Okay, then we have in here our content. Our content is related with my time. Okay, my time. Here I have some vocabulary pictures that you have to identify. The first picture is a boy who is writing a text on a notebook. is writing something, right, on his notebook. How you are going to say this or how you are going to identify this picture? He is writing a text on a notebook. Then we have, this is for the first picture, this one, okay? Reading, or in this case, writing a text. Second is, he is riding a bike. Riding a bike. Next picture, he is playing the guitar, playing the guitar. Next one, he is jumping, jumping. And the last picture is, he is washing the dishes or he is washing his hands. Okay. These are the pictures related with the vocabulary. Why? Because for this class, you are going to know something about likes, dislikes, love, hate, using present progressive. For that reason, we are adding ing at the end of the verb. For example, this, great, present progressive, writing, write, Present progressive, riding. Play, present progressive, pledging. The guitar. Jump, present progressive, jumping. Wash, present progressive, washing. Okay, let's continue. Then we have in here, like, don't like, love and hate. I suppose the majority of you knows the meaning of these words, but I'm going to tell you this in Spanish, okay? Like, me gusta, as you can see here, me gusta. Don't like, no me gusta. Love, amo. Hate, odio, lo que odia hacer, eso significa, ¿verdad? Then, we are going to continue with our students' book activities. Okay, what you are going to do in this moment is open your student's book, page number 34, and let's complete the first activity. Number one, the instruction says, listen and match the pictures with the names and the activities. These are the activities you are going to identify with these names. What are the names we have here? Sandra, Betty, Jane, Peter, and Daniel. I'm going to play the audio and you are going to identify this. Okay? Pay attention. Let me see here. Pay attention. 
Track 26. Listen and circle. My name's David. I want to join an after-school club. Which after-school club can I join? I'm not good at cooking. I always burn the food. I'm not good at music. I make lots of mistakes. I'm good at basketball. But there isn't a basketball club. I'm good at reading. But there isn't a book club. I'm not good at bowling. In fact, I'm terrible. Oh, but I'm good at running. I can run really fast. Which club can I join? Track 26. Okay. As you could listen, these are the pictures and these are the names you have to identify. Okay. Then I'm going to share the audio in order you can uh, complete this activity. Okay. Then we are going to continue with this. Activity number two. Write the name of your favorite activity or hobby. What is your favorite activity or hobby? Here you are going to write. If your favorite activity is um, playing soccer, here you are going to write my favorite activity or my favorite hobby is playing soccer. Then, activity number three, ask your classmates and complete the sentences. As everybody knows, we are not in a classroom for that reason. You are going to do it um, using different names. For example, mom likes to play an instrument, dad takes swimming lessons, um, my sister does gymnastics, my cousin, etc. Okay, boys and girls, thank you for your attention. Hello again. In order to continue our activities for this week, I'm going to explain you the next page you have to complete. That is page number 35. Remember, we are working in our student's book. In order to complete this activity, you are going to use your student's resource book too. Why? Because you are going to attach the stickers and you are going to glue them in the corresponding space. As you can see here, we have some little circles. What you are going to attach here? the sticker that is representing this activity. I'm going to explain you this. Love is represented by this face. Like this face, don't like this face, and hate this face. That is what you are going to do in this moment. Okay? And I'm going to play the audio, number 25, in order you can understand better in which place you are going to um, attach the stickers I already mentioned. Okay, listen. Track 25. Look, listen, and attach the words. One. I love learning karate. Hiya! What is the first? I love learning karate. Okay? I love. You are going to look for this face in your student's resource book and glue in this space. And here, love. Okay? Love. Two. I like going roller skating. It's fun. I like I hear, okay? Three. I don't like playing computer games. I don't like playing computer games. Don't like in this space. They're boring. Four. I hate taking violin lessons. 
I hate, hate taking violin lessons. Five. I love playing in the school band. It's a lot of fun. I love, he said. Six. I like chatting online with friends. I like seven. I don't like going to ballet class. I'm not a very good dancer. I don't like eight. I don't like taking swimming lessons. I don't like nine. I love doing gymnastics. I love doing gymnastics. Okay, boys and girls, here you have the next activity. Okay, let's complete it. Good luck. Have a nice day.